The city of Chula Vista brought in heavy equipment today to clear out homeless encampments along a bike path near Plaza Bonita Mall. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Marcella Lee. I'm Carlo Chiquetto. CBS 8 has been working for you on the situation along the Sweetwater Riverbed for months now. Our David Gobertson talked to the people on the ground today about the cleanup and about efforts to get housing for the people living in the encampments. This is the third time in as many months that CBS 8 cameras have recorded cleanup efforts along a bike path near the Plaza Bonita Mall. The Sweetwater Riverbed, where people have set up tents and makeshift shelters, crosses in and out of Chula Vista, the County of San Diego, National City, and Caltrans jurisdictions. The area being bulldozed this time falls in the city of Chula Vista. This area, called as and referred to as the jungle, has been an issue for some time now. The city's homeless solutions manager refers to the riverbed as the jungle. And she's quick to point out syringe needles and crack pipes found in the encampments. But she tells me the city of Chula Vista is trying to help those unhoused people get into shelters. So what we're trying to do is come in and give people the resources and the housing opportunities that we have. Give them an opportunity to take their belongings, storage if they need it, and then of course if they're ready and open for housing, we are ready. In May, Chula Vista opened up a brand new bridge shelter with 65 tiny homes. For those suffering from addiction, the city turns to the McAllister Institute to offer substance abuse treatment and education. A supervisor on site told me about 30 people who were living in the riverbed have been offered assistance. We need more detox beds. You know, it's like you get a client that comes in and says he wants to go to detox, and if you tell them come back tomorrow, they may never come back. They might come back a year from now, two years. The city of Chula Vista says they'll be here for at least another week clearing out this encampment. Of course, the problem is as soon as they leave, the unhoused people move back in and start setting up shop again. In Chula Vista, David Godfordson, CBS 8.